Welcome back, guys, to the epilogue, the final part, the finale of Danganronpa Trigger Happy Havoc. But even after saying it, it was all over, it's not like the building exploded or collapsed in or on itself or anything. That wasn't the kind of ending waiting for us. Nothing changed. Well, with one exception. The air purifier turned off. Just like Junko said, they shut off immediately. That was the only difference. We left the courtroom and made our way to the main hall. We stood in front of the door. Nobody made a sound. I felt almost absent-minded. This was our epilogue before the final ending. We were stuck there in limbo, unmoving, unsure. But in the end, hey. We can't just stand around like this forever. At some point we need to leave. To nobody's surprise, it was Kyoko who broke the silence. Makoto. Makoto, would you like to do the honors? Okay. As if awakened by Kyoko's words, I took out the object we'd gotten. Up until the moment of her death, it belonged to Junko. And in the end, she dropped it before us. So, um... But is that really it? Is that really the key to this door? Indeed. You don't have to read into it. What you don't have to read into what she said. Too much to find the answer. If, on the other hand, you desire to see us punished, then you must all leave this place. I will force you out, ensuring you all die horrible deaths in the outside world. In other words. I will force you out, she said that just before dropping down. It all makes sense that it would be our way out of here. But... But you never know, maybe it's actually a switch that's gonna make the school self-destruct? I mean, Junko never specifically said she let us out of here alive. That's true? It's true. You may be right about that. <laughs> maybe? Yes. Even so, it's impossible to think we wouldn't take our chances with it. Uh, um... Yeah, I guess that's true. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. My if, if something ever happened to Master, I take my scissors and jam it up so far up. Huh? huh? Where's the courtroom? Where's the mastermind? Oh. It's all over. We were just about to leave the school. <laughs> leave? We can go outside? <laughs> that means me and Master can get married? And then he'll give me a little jewel of a baby? That's enough. Please stop, that would be a greater horror than anything I've encountered so far. Anyway. Anyway, don't worry, I doubt we have I have no doubt that we'll be able to leave here without a problem. But if that's what happens after we get out that I'm worried about. What? <sighs> but you know, in the end I I think part of me still thinks We're serious. Maybe when we get out of here we'll see that everything she said about the world was a lie. That on the other hand of the store, on the other side of the store, is a world as peaceful as we remember. A lie, peaceful as we remember. Well, no matter what it looks like, it's still our world. It's where we're meant to live. Uh, um. Yeah, I guess so. And how do I put this? Unlike this school, the world is really big, right? Since it's so big, I'm sure there must be some despair no matter what. But there also has to be lots of hope, right? In other words... The act of searching for hope, to try and find it, that itself is the true meaning of hope. As long as you have that hope, you can keep moving forward no matter what trouble you may fall into. Am I wrong? Is that what you mean, Makoto? Yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. <laughs> I don't need any of you to spell it out for me. You know, Junko mentioned there are still others out there who hadn't cast away hope just yet. <laughs> Maybe I should find them and make them work for me. To rebuild the world, we must first rebuild the Togami Dynasty. Jesus. 
I'll go with you. I'll follow you anywhere you want to go. You got it. Well, my first stop is going to be the closest donut shop. I can figure out the rest from there. Hey. What are you going to do if there are no more donut shops or donuts? Okay. I'll just get some flour and make some myself. And if there's no flour, I'll just grow some wheat. <laughs> uh, I get it now. Hmm. If there's no road, you gotta build one. Creation. Fate is telling me to remake the world. Could it be? That's my hope. How about that? I reached the next stage. The next chapter of Yasuhiro Kagakure's life story is about to begin. Woo! Thanks, Hina. You totally opened up my eyes. Ooh. Hey, hey, personal space, buddy. You're seriously creeping me out. Makoto. Come on, Makoto. Even if everyone in the outside world is gone... Even if the world is steeped into despair, <laughs> as long as I have people like you around, I can face forward and keep moving. Oh, you can say that again, baby. Let's go. If we can get out of here and do something, have some sort of impact. But what can we do? There's so few of us and we're so small. What can we do? No, we can probably do anything. Yeah, we can do anything. Yeah. <gasps> Let's just like spam hope over and over again. Well, Let's go. Guess this is goodbye. And goodbye to Sakura. But hey, if we gotta say goodbye, we may as well do it with a smile on our face. Hey guys, you guys want your fortunes told anywhere, anytime. You just let me know. I'll be there. You know how much I hate being annoyed. But if something does come up, you may as well let me know. I can't guarantee I'll actually bother listening, but, you know. I don't know why, but I have a burning desire to start writing. I might be able to pull it off. A story about Master and me, and the others, I guess. I can't say I'm sorry about what happened, but still, it does feel kind of strange. I really don't know what to say. I guess we graduated? It looks like hope really is spreading. As long as I never give up, I have to push even harder. I'm going to keep moving forward with hope in my heart. Since I have hope, I can show courage. Since I have hope, I can move ahead. The world can move ahead. The door began to open with my hands with our hands. Hope and despair mingle together, opening the door to the future. Holy moly. I can't believe it. The game's finally over. Dude, every time a game... Dude, every time a game finishes, I swear I get really sad that the game's over. Like, I... It's just like that feeling where you can't believe it's over, you know? Oh my god. It's the exact same feeling I have with every single game every time I complete something. It's crazy.
What a game. Oh, there's more. <laughs> interesting. Things are getting very interesting indeed. <laughs> like I said at the beginning, I'm not a teddy bear. I am Monokuma. And I am your... I am this school's... Headmaster. Interesting. Oh, wow. Well, that was it, folks. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, there is actually more. There's like a bunch of extras that you can unlock with Monokuma coins, I think. Then there's school mode. Well, school mode is basically... Uh, I looked up a bit. It's basically just... Uh, free time Free time mode It's basically free time mode Where you can just Unlock every single Event like Conversation Do a bunch of shit There's a little mini game along to it Where you get characters to do Things Like I don't know collect wood or some shit like that Like collect resources or something it's a little, it's just a mini game, it's an extra. I might do it as a bonus episode, but most likely not. I'll only do it if I really feel like it. Well, other than that, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time on my next playthrough. We don't know when that might be, but. Without further ado, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Shunflower out.